All Free Knitting and All Free Crochet is proud to announce our fourth annual Prayer Shawls for Charity. Last year, we donated 340 shawls to patients at Rush Medical Center in Chicago, and this year we want to beat that number. Well, I saw the email that came out through Rush that talked about this project, and I was like, well, I haven't crocheted in a while. I have a bin of yarn upstairs that I need to do something with, and this is such a great thing to do. We get the shawls that folks knit, um, and it's really fun for us to be able to think about giving them out to patients. Um, many patients are here from several hours away. They haven't brought touches of home with them, um, and oftentimes they're dealing with really serious things. So to be able to ask them what their favorite color is and bring something in that's not so institutional is really nice. I like a shawl that gives a complete hug, and so as I'm making it, I can kind of judge by the amount and pressure that's on my lap as I'm knitting away of the weight of it and how it's going to feel on someone's shoulders. So when I feel like the hug is complete, then I know that my shawl is complete. We see people in intensive care units. We see people being treated for cancer. We see people in the general medical floors in rehab. Um, so these really go all over the hospital. I always finish my shawls with a little charm that says made for you with love. And I sew it in a little corner. So hopefully the patients that get my shawls not only enjoy the color and the warmth of the shawl, but also if they find the little charm, maybe have something a little extra just to kind of, um, you know, rub between their fingers as they're going through treatments or maybe in the middle of the night need a little extra. Somebody out there is thinking about them. There's one lady and, and she's actually, she's still here. So she's 86 and she's being treated for cancer and she's just the most gentle, kind lady, um, but she's far from home. Um, other family members have had illnesses since she's been here, so her own family isn't able to be here quite as often. And we had given her a shawl a few weeks ago, and she's still, I'll, I'll come in and find, find her with that. And she says it's a, nice, it's a nice way to remember her family and a nice way to, to have that comfort when, when her family can't be here. You can send shawls to our office between October 1st and November 15th. Our address and instructions are listed on the website. By participating, you will be entered to win a bundle of yarn from Red Heart Yarn. We would love for you to share your progress on social media, so please use the hashtag YarnItForward. We can't wait to see what you create and we thank you in advance for participating in this really amazing charity drive. Again, this is our fourth annual Prayer Shawls for Charity and we can't wait to see what you create. <laughs>